Welcome back everyone to another video here on Nasha Vlogs and um well first thing got a new mic first one got nicked by my neighbour who's an utter cunt well it's true you're a cunt simple um but apart from calling my neighbour a cunt today it's part two of the roast of Nasha Vlogs because we had more people send stuff in and let's just say some of you were digging up some old material. And by that I mean about a year and a half worth of old material. So think of something creative. So let's kick straight in with the comments from the premiere of the part one, which were absolutely hilarious. I'm not going to say the names of who said it because they know who they are. Simple, they know who they are. Very funny, very original. So the first comment from the premiere of part one was He thinks the inspiration thing is true. Yep, that's it. Exposed. <laughs> you know, I I get that a lot. I get that a lot, people think when someone calls me an inspiration. I genuinely think it's real. But let's be truly honest here. YouTube isn't real anymore. It's fake. There's nothing truthful about YouTube anymore. We're all, you know, copying other people. There's no, there's no, there's no real true YouTubers anymore, to be honest. Now, the next few comments are all from the same person. He knows who he is. And that's, he kills it with a dead joke. Another mum joke, dead comedy. Yep. My comedy's dead apparently. My comedy is so dead it came with its own do not resuscitate note. What the fuck am I on about? And back to the comments. Now this next comment is something I got sent ages ago. It hasn't been put on a video, but it was on a Facebook message, and I think I get this, and Ryan has been called this a lot. Talking about Ryan, stop fucking messaging me! Thank you. Right. And the comment is, jealous of success. Yeah. Yeah, just... Uh, next comment, please. And the next comment is Jacksepticeye Wannabe. Now, this is going back to, um, you know, this is talking about old material. If you remember back in 2018, I dyed my hair green. Uh, that was influenced by Jacksepticeye, I'm not going to lie. And a lot of the stuff I've done on this channel before with Jacksepticeye, I've done alter egos. I took the piss out of his anti thing. Ryan did as well at one point. Um... Yeah, I copied his gaming chair, which he no longer has, so it can't be a copy, ish. And obviously, I started doing the top of the morning thing for a while, and um, yeah, yeah, I'm just a, I'm just a B Tech Jacksepticeye. Very original. Anyone who calls me a Jacksepticeye wannabe clearly has some sort of issue with me copying someone famous, whether you're a dedicated fan or what. Like I said, YouTube isn't real anymore. No one on YouTube is real, you know? And if you think I'm copying Jacksepticeye, then that's fair enough, everyone's open to have their own opinion. But like, firstly, he makes better videos than me, so how can I be copying him, right? It's, it just sounds like a fucking rant right here, don't it, Mum? Oh shit. Now this next comment is from my good friend Josh Gaming and it's is the taco shop closed? Really? Fuck's sake. Better shut down the fucking channel. People think I'm a fucking Mexican. Fuck off you bitch. I told you I'm not fucking Mexican. I'm not going to lie, that's something I'm getting slightly pissed off at now, is that people 
because Ryan started doing a joke calling me Mexican because of how I looked on live streams, as soon as Ryan stopped doing that joke, everyone starts calling me a fucking Mexican and asks me, do I have a taco shop? I do not! And even if I did, it'd probably get shut down. Not by the health inspectors, I'd just shut it down. Because I'm, you know, I hate people! Another comment I get sent quite a lot is, why do you steal other people's jokes? This is going back to the Jacksepticeye thing, you know. Another one is from a good friend of mine, Windows Vista, who's a YouTuber, who watches my videos quite a lot. And his comment is, my brother thinks you're weird. And I think your brother's a cunt. Deal with it. And the final comment is for, is, um, how do you know about deodorant? Are we really doing these jokes now? Come on. Think of something original for fuck's sake. Anyway, that's all the comments. Um, interesting. Interesting. Um, I genuinely want to talk about the you fake subscribers thing. Now, this happened ages and ages ago. If you're going to use material, guys, come up with something creative. Don't use old material. Come on. We... It's a thing that happened and went. I bought 1.5 thousand subscribers and then YouTube deleted them all towards the end of 2018. So my channel went down. I lost subscribers, views, lost my reputation. What fucking reputation? Anyway, um, like, comment and subscribe if you have any more memes. You know, send them in and I might do a part three. Um, so I've been another meme someone sent me last year which... I get associated with all the time is when I did a video last year I said the line three likes and we'll do another one of this that was a genuine fuck up of speaking English so stop using that meme against me please anyway thanks for watching see you in the next video peace out